Alexios had to take care of his sick father, if I hope to be remembered. Alexios, I haven't seen you since you took me to the ruins of Odysseus. Odessa, you remember? How could I forget? You told me to live my own life, and care less about someone else's greatness. Looks like you're taking my advice. <sighs> I've been forced to take care of my sick father, so no. I've had no chance to live the life I desire. No wonder you're upset. You want to be out exploring, but you're stuck here instead. I'm glad somebody gets it. If you don't like it, do something about it. Not until my father is better. I need to get a couple of things for him. Maybe you could help me. Don't worry. I'm here to help. What do you need? A few herbs from the Valley of King Lelech nearby. Also need a mixture from the market to combine with the herbs. There's a merchant there holding on to it for me. Is your father really so sick you can't get them yourself? I'm his only child. I'd rather be close by in case he gets worse. Do you know what's wrong with him? No, only that he's not getting better. The mixture and herbs I need may help with the pain at least. If he dies, all his land will be yours, right? Yes, but I'd sell it anyway. What better reason to leave everything behind and truly begin my quest, like Odysseus? What's your connection to Odysseus? I'm a descendant of his. I'm named after him too. Stay by your father. I'll be back with the herbs and the mixture. Those are the herbs Odessa needs. Merchant should be the one Odessa mentioned. Tell your friends, tell your family, the best wares Drachmi can buy. Even mercenaries like you can find something. Odessa sent me. Ah, of course. Sweet girl, I wish she had stopped by herself. This is for her father, I imagine? I'll take the payment and you can be on your way. Here, take it. Quick sales are my favorites. I hope this helps Odessa.
for the leader of Megaris. Seems like Odessa's been causing some problems for them. And they're also after her father's estate. Are the herbs and mixture okay? You did get them, didn't you? That's what you're worried about? We were just attacked. Surely you should be used to that by now. Random bandits litter these lands. What did that letter you were reading say? That they were after you, and only you. Not me. I can't believe it. Looks like it deals with your father's estate. They probably want you and him both gone so they can take it. I could have died. Without making a name for myself. I'd never be worth anything at all. I won't let anyone hurt that face. No pain, no glory. How about you take me inside and show me a little pain? Oh, how I would love to do so. But this news... Someone aims to kill me. How could we possibly ignore such a thing for pleasure? Then where does that leave us? With a task at hand, clearly. Think what you must, but I can prove the truth to you. I just need your help. I'm not surprised. I'll let you know if you can have it. Are you ready to find the whole truth of what's going on? Always. I knew you would. You already believe they're after me, and you're right. I want to have proof in my hand saying why. The truth always comes out. It will. And then I can finally follow in the footsteps of Odysseus. Don't the stories of Odysseus mention how great of a lover he was? Do they? I must have missed those. You said you want to be like Odysseus. We could do better than that. We will talk more about us once this is all done. First, the note you found was from the leader of Megaris. There has to be proof of what he's up to. Uh, if there is, it would be at his home. Then go there. I'll find the proof you need. Good. I want this whole thing to be over. Do you have any idea what I'm looking for? The leader is the most powerful man in Megaris. I can't accuse him of anything unless I have proof that he's after me. Let's say I do find the truth you're looking for. What next? Then I'd tell everyone who would listen. The leader wouldn't dare kill me or my father once everyone knows their plans. I'll be back with proof, whatever it may be. I should head to the leader's house to find out what's going on. That's the place. Any proof to be found should be there. I need to be careful. This place is heavily guarded. I should try to stay out of sight.
this letter mentions Odessa's estate, and how crucial it is that they get it. By any means necessary. One of Odessa's suitors died mysteriously, shortly after meeting her. The leader of Megaris tried arranging a marriage for Odessa. Sounds like an easy way to get her father's estate. This letter claims that Odessa hired other mercenaries. I wonder why. Not a fucking thing. Huh? Where is that coming from?
The leader of Megaris is after Odessa's estate, and he's tried arranging a marriage for her to take control of it after her father dies. But these letters also claim one of her suitors was killed, and nobody's sure how. Though she's been known to hire other mercenaries, it's difficult to tell if Odessa is in the wrong or not. You've returned. I hope with good news. Before we get serious, how about we finally have some fun? I appreciate your help, but I'm not sure. I thought there was something between us. At times it felt that way, but not enough for me. Let's keep our focus on what's important here. You've hired other mercenaries. Oh, just for odd jobs here and there. There's always something to be done that could use one. A man you were meant to marry was killed suddenly. I... He was probably killed by the same people who want to kill me. After everything I found, I know what's going on. And what's that? You don't deserve any of this. You're only trying to live your life. Of course I am. I've done nothing wrong. I just want to have a healthy father and to start my journey. You can start that after we have a little fun. I do enjoy your attempts. Tell me, what is it that's meant to make me swoon this time? If you undress me, I think you'll find out. I can do that. Mm. That was enough to make me swoon. Told you. So that's it then. I guess there's nothing else to do. doesn't have to be goodbye. Why not join my crew? Hmm. Well, you were always on my side. Plus, getting away from here would be nice. Great. What about your father? He's been feeling a lot better, thanks to you. You aren't worried someone will come after him? I'll be sure to share the information you found with a few people. They won't touch him so long as we have it. Then I'm happy to have you aboard.
So, did you kill your father? Step, father. I suppose the gods won't judge you too harshly for a step patricide. Nikolaus raised me, trained me. He was my father, even if he did try to kill me. Is that better or worse? No matter. Yours isn't the only complicated family in the world. Thanks. I'm glad to have you around, Varnavas. I am happy to be here. Would anything else help? Finding my mother. She's alive, Varnavas. At least, Nikolaus thought so. Some good news, praise Ira. What's your plan? What course should I set, Captain? For now, we go to Fukis. Elpinor said he'd meet me there. He owes me money. And an explanation. I, Alexios. And let's seek the wisdom of the Pythia while we're there. If anyone has answers for you, it's the Oracle of Delphi. I'll think about it. Good. You know, kings and queens travel to Fokis to consult the Pythia. She can start wars or end them. They say that... Yes, I know. That's enough Oracle talk for now. Hmm. Back to business. You know where to meet Elpinor, I suppose? His home is in Pilgrim's Landing. But... Nikolaus's last words to me were a warning of snakes in the grass. Sounds like you should make extra preparations. Elpinor is the one who should prepare. Meet me at Apollo's temple in Delphi when you're done dealing with the snakes. Elpinor has a lot of explaining to do. In position for sailing! Commander! Back! I remember Mother's stories of Hira and the Sacred Wars. I wonder if she ever came here.
Aristios. How was Megaris? The wolf is dead. Excellent. The full amount is promised. You expected me to haggle? Come now, Alexios. It isn't every day I have someone kill their own father. But he wasn't your real father, was he? How did you know that Nikolaus was my stepfather? I love theater. All of the arts, really. A great general throws his own children off a cliff on the say-so of the Oracle. It is a tragedy for the ages. You think my life is entertainment? Oh, no, my friend. It is art. I know, I know. It's a lot to take in all at once. Come. Tell me, Mistyos, did you learn anything worthwhile in your dealings with the wolf? He mentioned my birth father. He might still be alive. Not for long, if all goes according to plan. What do you mean? You are going to bring me his head, of course. Have you lost your mind? You killed the man who raised you for Drachmi. I merely assumed you wanted your family dead as much as I do. Malaka! You think you can play with me? I'll cut out your tongue! So disappointing. Bako! away like a coward. I should investigate his house. A letter to Alpinor. Oh, Phoebe. You led him right to me. Alpinor's looking for a woman. I wonder who he wants in his slimy grasp now. This is a ship manifest. Elpinor selling weapons to both Athens and Sparta. He wants this war to go on forever. I have met some treacherous people. None of them compare to Elpinor. I'm going to look under every rock, in every shadow, until I find and kill this vile serpent. Your yes! What's your problem? What don't I have fucking problems with? The Oracle for one, C for another, and don't get me started on my crew. You have business with the Oracle? 
You're a long way from Delphi. Had business. And my business is none of your fucking business. I ain't shopping for a merc. If anything, I need the gods. If you want something done, you'll have to do it yourself. <laughs> You're right there. Can't trust the gods or their servants. So, who are you? Captain Yellon of the Shark's Tooth. Shark Tooth's your boat? Do I look like a fucking fisherman? I sail a ship, not a boat. It was just a question. I'm here to help. Oh, it's not your fault. After my business with the Oracle, I came to meet my ship and crew. That was a day ago, and they're nowhere to be found. So, you sought the Oracle's advice? Her? Pfft, fuck no! I'd rather seek counsel in the wind from my ass. Then why seek her out? We got a deal. I suppose no harm in telling you. She lets me know where the pilgrims are coming from. Then I supply the transport for their journey, and we split the fee. So you're trying to tell me the Oracle has divine intuition of where the pilgrims will be coming from? <laughs> Fuck no. She asks her believers how full the ports are. Then she tells me. Simple. You have business here in Fokis? I got business everywhere. Right now, it's where's my fucking ship? So where's the shark's tooth? I wouldn't fucking be here if I knew, would I? Okay, let me rephrase. Where was the crew meant to be? Well, um, I sent my girl Yiki off. Pilgrims get stuck in the shallows around here, and, uh, we sort of help out. Oh, your girl? Yeah, best hand I ever had, and more. Look, find my ship and my Yiki, will you? I'll pay. I'll find out what happened and bring them back. Do you know where they could have gone? The southeastern shore is pretty rich pickings. Nice cove there to trap lost, wealthy pilgrims. You're a pirate. What if I fucking am? I'm the pirate that's paying you. Anyway, I'm not a pirate all the time. It's more of a hobby. A hobby? You sure the crew didn't mutiny and run off on you? Not with my yiki at the helm. Plus, they never got the cut from our last trip. They wouldn't leave without getting paid. Describe Giki. She's beautiful, she is. Kisses like summer. From the first time I saw her, I wanted to eat her all up. Not helpful? Okay, okay. She's raven-haired, and has a precious band on her arm that I gave her. Always wears it. I'll find them and return as soon as I can. Ella. Come <laughs> on. 
Careful not to get spotted. It's the description of Yiki's armband.
Tell Gellon about the Kiki. Found your ship. And? Come on now, where are they? Where's my Yiki? I really don't know how to tell you this. Oh, for fuck's sake. Zeus could have impregnated the whole of Athens in the time it takes you to say anything. Where are they? They're dead, all right? And your ship's gone too. Oh, my Yiki. All I found is her armband. Yiki. I suppose I'm not much of a captain now. Can't be a captain without a ship. I can offer you a place on my crew. I know it's not like having your own ship, but you'll be part of a family. Hmm. Well, I'd rather be at sea than stuck here with these pious idiots. You got yourself a deal. Just till I'm back on my feet. Of course. Now, where is your boat? Ship? <laughs> it's called the Adrestia. Whatever you say, Captain. 